Hello everybody. Sometimes when I'm driving, okay, I'm today up here in the mountains, I just uh, stop. Like there's this little place right here. I just park the car. And then I get out and walk around to see what there is to see. Just to kind of learn what there might be in the area and if there's anything to discover. And uh, indeed I discovered something. Have a look. I had to uh, hop over this uh, guardrail here. And I was actually looking for bugs. I'm hoping to find um, hornets. You guys know me and hornets. Hey, look, I'm not dressed in dark colors, so I'm not too dark. I found one yellow hornet, but it wasn't the uh, big one I'm after. I was going to head over there into that deep foliage and look around. And then I looked over here and caught something. Something caught my eye. Whoa. What the heck is that? Excuse the noise of the traffic. It'll be incessant through this video, I think. And what is this? Let's look at this first. It's two bamboo poles. A pair of uh, bamboo poles. Straight up out of the ground. Now, I'm looking at this for the first time. I stopped, I, I stopped and grabbed the camera and started filming as soon as I saw these. So I, I didn't take a close look at any of this yet. I haven't been back here. What is this weird bamboo and it's got a slot on the top. This one here has a slot on the top too and lots of vines all over it. How stable is it? Very stable. For, it doesn't look too old. I don't know. Strange. What the heck is this? I'm seeing six sounds great, late autumn, or mid-autumn. Ooh, gotta watch the spiders. Big one right there. Hello, spider, sorry. Coming through, coming through. Sorry to break your web here. Get all kinds of stuff, oh, seeds on me. What the heck is this? You know what this looks like, everybody? This looks like an exercise bar. You know one of those things you would swing from when you were a kid at the park, at the playground, at your school? Moths everywhere. Wow, it's a step. Moths are flying up out of all of this. Whoa, big spider. Right there. <laughs> you just know I'm going to get... Spider's another one there. I'm going to get a spider on me. Yeah. Let's get closer without breaking these webs. These spiders put a lot of energy into these webs. It really does look like an exercise bar, doesn't it? What a strange, weirdo thing to have out here in the middle of nowhere. Let's bang it. That's pretty solid. I think that's what it is. But why? Okay, let's go over here. So, anything else to see? Sorry, dragonfly. Oh, there's a bucket. Look at that. An old rusted bucket. Let's go through here. I see a tire. There's a tire. Hoodoo. Hoodoo? You do. Voodoo. Scooby-Doo. What? There's a fence. I see a fence. Now we're... I'm at the edge of a big cliff, I think, so... There should be a big cliff over here. What the world is that? Ooh, big spider boy. Ooh, or spider girl. There's the boy. Scary bird sound. It's starting to seem like a horror movie. Big rock. making that noise is right over there. Bird of some sort, I suspect. Whoa. Now, I don't think it's showing up in the camera, but that is a wall, a solid wall, 
of giant spider webs. The golden orb weaver owns this territory. Let's go over this way. I'm not so afraid of the spiders, although I am afraid of spiders. I'm more spooked of the, uh, or sad about breaking all their webs they work so hard on. Listen to that. Isn't that cool? I love places like this. When I lived in the uh, United States, I never talk about my life in the United States, but when I lived in the United States, I did this stuff all the time. No video cameras back then. I'd park the car in the middle of nowhere and go wander off, but I would had my uh, pack and all my gear back then. I would go out for a day or so, stay overnight, sleep in the scariest, spookiest place, animal sounds at night. Those are gory times. Wow, now, I'm pretty sure we're at the edge of the cliff here. See this fence? It's a big precipitous drop. This uh, mountain that I'm on was once a riverbed for the Abe River. And it's about a, probably a good mm, 115, maybe, no, maybe 100 meters drop. A 300 foot drop or so. Now, <clears throat> I don't see anything else that's spookier. The place itself has got the atmosphere alone. I still wonder what that was, that little exercise thing, a band and exercise bar, because this has been exercise station along an old trail. What's up there? Look at that. Can you see that butterfly floating gently over there? Ooh. Mysteries of what's beyond. I'm going to come back here later in the fall. I promise to do so. I'm going to come back here later in the fall after the spiders have gone into hibernation so I don't break all their webs. And I'm going to find out what's back here. Until then, thanks as always for joining me and having fun and seeing what, what's out there in the world. Scooby Scooby Doo, where are you? Ba 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 ba. If we can't count on you, Scooby Doo, the dun 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 dun. dun.